learn how to go ahead and install Comfy UI on your MacBook so you can get unlimited image generation completely for free for your business. Um, I just quickly asked ChatGPT how to do it and we can go through it together. So let's start by this, see if, see if this works. Cool. So now I'm going to start by downloading Comfy UI. Next is we want to go ahead and create the virtual environment. Once we're in, we want to go ahead and install the required dependencies in this virtual environment. Now let's go ahead and try run it. Fingers crossed it works. Hopefully it's that simple. Let's see, let's see. Using all my RAM, 16 gigabytes of it. Let's see if it works. Okay, let's use this link. Fingers crossed it works. Awesome, it works. We're missing a model. Um, but it freaking worked. Can't believe it. Let's let's quickly act, add in a model. Because I have a model from stable diffusion model. Epic realism. Right, this also pruned. So let's go ahead and find the comfy AI. Comfy UI, here it is. Let's go to models. Uh, which one will be in a checkpoint? So apparently you can put it into a checkpoint. So let me just move it here. Because I don't want to double up another 4.3 gigabytes. Um, and let's see if it worked. So let me go ahead and restart it. Control C. Um, and then to run it, I think I just go ahead and so let's go ahead and go to the Comfy UI folder. I think we're already there. Let's go ahead and just run it. Python main. This should start it up. Refresh, and there should be a model in the, in it now. And bam, as you can see. The 1.5 pruned, whatever this one is. Let me try, what is this? I forgot what I downloaded. Mm. <laughs> this is pretty crap. Actually, it's not too bad. Well, it looks pretty bad. Well, I guess it's quite unique. Okay, how do I play this? So let's try create like a Asian DJ in front of a crowd at a festival. I'm gonna click Q. Prompts failed, what checkpoint? The value is not, what? Is it cause I got the wrong model? Okay, since it didn't work, let me just put in a brand new model. So let's get an image sys. This will give you the most popular models. Okay, the rank number one Flux Pro. So let's go ahead and get this. Go to um, Civic V, yeah, models, paste. Oh, I hate how there's just so many. It makes it confusing. I don't know which one's the right one. Um, I guess this one because it has 21,000 downloads. But it doesn't, it's not, it doesn't look exactly the same. Flux.1 Pro. Okay. I'm one with 
42,000 downloads, so that must be really good. So let's go to this 42,000 one. Whoa, 11 gigabytes. Wow, the images are pretty solid though. All right, fuck it, let's just spend 11 gigabytes. Okay, just finished downloading 11.5 gigabytes. Take the set, safe tensor file from the downloads. Um, go to Comfy UI, models, checkpoints, paste it here. And let me just refresh, reload. Okay, I'm gonna have to restart it. Go ahead and launch it. Python main. So I think it's reconnecting now. There you go. Refresh. And there we have the flux. So let's try it now. Yes, it works. Uh, okay. Why is it not working? Help fix this. Okay, because maybe I'm, I'm in a Mac or something. Let's solve why this is happening. Okay, let me relaunch Comfy UI with the split cross attention. Let's stop it. Let's relaunch it with this. Refresh, reload. Same issue. Let me troubleshoot this. So I think this is just too heavy for me. So let's go ahead and just delete the 12 gigs, what a waste. Um, let's try real viz Excel. Oh wow, there's a version 5.0. Six gigs. Let's double check if this can work on a MacBook. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna download it. to like up here crop it done chop can this run on my MacBook M1 without issues? So there's like a compatibility test. So I have a 16 gigabyte M1, so it should work. So let's go ahead and just, I guess, download it. I'll be right back. Finally downloaded, that's 6.5 gigs. Let's give this a try. Move to the checkpoint. Drop terminal. Let's restart this. Refresh. Let's 
Should I have the real vs now? Let's kill it. Okay, it's green. It's working. Wow, I can see the computer's lagging already. So it went through here, went through here, now it's at the K sampler. I guess it's doing something. Wow, let's see the activity monitor. Yeah, a lot of the memory is being used. The CPU is okay. Okay, let's see. So this is the loading. This is pretty cool, it's like a it's like a flow. I don't know what this is, but I guess it's a decoder. And bam, image. This is pretty cool. So this is the Asian DJ in front of a crowd at a festival. This is pretty cool, not gonna lie. So yeah, I guess that's how you go ahead and install and use Comfy UI on a MacBook.